Hello, hello everybody and welcome to another Let's Play. I'm Miles Dyer and today we are checking out Mixture. I want to say a massive thank you to Played With Fire and Perp Games for providing me with a game key. And a massive hello to anyone that is watching live. You'll notice that I'm a bit lower uh, on camera than I am. And it's just because I didn't fix the tripod after filming a particular promo you'll be excited to see about a future Let's Play. But enough about that. Hello to everyone in the live chat. I will be able to hear you in just a moment after giving this quick introduction. And hello to anyone that's watching on replay. If you're watching on replay, let me know your thoughts in the comments section and I'll see you there afterwards. But mixture, here we are in this world. I've had to turn down the gamma quite a bit so it's um, better for you to see on the live stream. And first things first. I kept wondering how to reset your position, and it's actually you use the right stick uh, a little bit to do it. Uh, right, let's have a look here. We want gameplay, I guess. Aiming, difficulty, easy, normal. Oh, just do normal. Accessibility, here we go. Turning mode, smooth, snap. I like smooth as default, respect that. Respect that a lot. And vignette strength, that goes all the way down. Okie dokie. And I think without further, oh there we go. There's, if that is the fastest smooth turning, I mean, my goodness. Um, these gloves are nice. But um, right, I think we're ready to go. So I'm just gonna say hello to the chat. I can hear you now. Hello, hello chat. And um, Hit the stick to recenter. There we go. I like this little dot here. Clear your game data and start. I guess so. I haven't got any game data. I already said normal, but I like that you asked me again, just in case I had second thoughts. Loading. Oh, wow. Throwing and hitting targets is a central mechanic of mixture. Wow, I've got you coming in my ears really loud. Hello, everyone. How are we doing? How are we doing? Um, press and hold R1 to get mixture. Yeah, you don't need fast, uh, smooth turn for this game. Then throw mixture at the target. So oh, That's interesting. Hit three different targets. I like that. The haptics are really good. If you find normal throws to be too challenging, consider the aim assist mode. Depending on preference, there's a lot of uh, there is a reprojection. It's very blurry when you're moving side to side. But again, for this kind of game, probably not going to need to move around too much. First press to get mixture in hand. Look at your target directly. Wait for it to appear. Oh, it's not eye tracking. It's before before changing focus. Okay, that's not right. So look at your target directly. Wait for mixture icon to appear on target. Throw at target before changing focus. Throw now. Okay, I've got to just throw it a bit more. Okay. I don't know. Am I meant to be doing it like that? I guess so. I thought it was like an arrow, but... A dagger. Try out both modes... At will also move targets. I want aim assist off. Look at that. Didn't need aim assist. I want to hit that big thing in the distance. Not going to be able to reach it. Let's start the game. You can always toggle between the aim assist and normal throwing in the settings. Okay, thank you very much. That is one hell of a loading screen. <laughs> <laughs> I like how loading screens tend to be subtle, and this is like, nope, we're going to tell you what we are. We're a loading screen.
loading. Ah, oh, horrible. Oh wow, this is cool. Hello, little fella. Look around. Yeah, that's what I'm doing. Oh, there we go. I am unchained, and yet I have no physical form. What trickery is this? Can it be? The haptics are good. Can it be? Are you really a, an alchemist? I am a ghost. I am but a ghost of my former self. A super being in ethereal ethereal indisposition. A spirit tethered to this medallion. You are an alchemist. An ancient tyrant of the realm of matter. My name was Sepharius. Sepharius? Sepharius? Who are you then? I am Sola, knight of the fallen order, defender of the gateway to the realm of light. You don't look like a light strider, but I do sense some glimmer inside that armour. Perhaps I should inspect more closely. Keep your ghostly fingers to yourself, brewer. Press and hold R1 to get mixture in hand, yeah? And then throw mixture at Moth. That's not very nice. Your mixture has no effect. Could it be because I bear your medallion? So very curious. You are one of the light. The shell is just for appearances. Uh, I used to be of the light, and I will be again with your help. A tempting offer, but I am weak from my long confinement. My powers cleaved and clouded. On second thought, I should put you back in the shiny medallion for another thousand years. Hmm. A dose of rashness is a necessary catalyst for certain daring mixtures. I thought you might see things my way. Right. Okay, cool. I'm moving the character now. Got a dash. Attack. That's cool. Anything I can destroy here? Nope. And we're off. This is like moss meets. It's like moss meets Astrobot. Oh, that's kind of cool. You don't really feel anything when you hit them. Press X to dash and overcome. Oh. Select and magnetically pull in base element sulfur by directing your left hand over and pressing L2. Interesting. Can I do that as well? Oh, hit, see my mixture. Here we are. Throw mixture by choosing which target to focus on. Throw. Okay. So you literally make a mixture. Can I like go over there or am I just going in a straight line? Okay. Okay. What's this? Do I want to use a mixture to... How are the sound levels in that, everyone? Are they alright? No, that didn't work. Hmm. Oh, is it that when you do that... There we go. But that didn't do anything. 
There we go, that did. Interesting. Enter fiery symbols to activate checkpoints. You'll return there in the case of the reversed. Game seems low. Yeah, sometimes uh, I need to... There we go, I've turned it up a little bit there. It's really hard to... Games are just so inconsistent in their sound levels. And I've been quite cold, quite quiet on the last ones. So as long as you can hear me as well, and the mix is fine. Finally, finally, I can leave this murky dungeon. Stay put, Light Strider. I can sense a strange residue of enhanced sulfur ahead. I have no time for your al alchemic mumbles. Alchemist, I'm going. No, wait, Light Strider. That's unwise. I'm not controlling now. Hi there. Oh, wow. That's huge. Scary looking. Pay attention to the openings from which the wind is blowing. Use the glue mixture to block them. Glad it's a good mixture, the sound. to wait until it comes forward, I guess. There we go. Take that. How was I supposed to avoid that? Was I... Oh, there we go. I don't know. I find the sound in this game really, like, underwhelming. Like, it just all feels so dead and peaceful. Like, I feel like that should have been really, like, upbeat. Not upbeat, but, like epic, like you're in a massive battle against a big beast and it just didn't really feel like anything. Do you get what I mean? Did it come across like that for you? Do you recognise it's alchemy? I believe I do. And it is mine. You created this snake golem. No, it is a vicious avatar created for my stolen power, a personalised prison guard created by the light. Indeed, you do not know how to make enemies. Nobody messes with the light. We alchemists didn't get close to showing it its place. With the left hand, hold onto the magnetic particle with L2 and move it along the connected lines. Yes, my powers of old are released back to me. I feel more whole already. You are still just a flowing, floating apparition. I think you still have some way to go. You are just envious of my triumph. Hey, you had a little help with that, remember? A few distracting acrobatics, but for all your gyrations, you have led us to a dead end. Dark swallow its hole. The dungeon has collapsed in on itself. We are locked away from my point of entry. So can I go over here? 
like that, or is that just saying in the background? No. When you're looking behind me, that's a cool environment, like the stuff hanging from the ceiling and stuff. But like, there's so much Mura. And for those that don't know what Mura is, it's when it's like, it looks grey, not black. So what now, Light Strider? Are we going to spend an eternity together in this cellar doing nothing but inhaling these sulfurous fruit fumes? I suppose for all your plans and potions, you still have a thing or two to learn from me. Help me reach that bright spot up there. All right, we have a little less talking. I like this though, that it shows you what you've got of each one. That's kind of cool. And I guess now, yeah, two mixtures now. With Repel Mixture, you can make certain surfaces bounceable. Whee! Wait, was that an Astrobot bounce thing? Duck. Master Kane Octavia, I'm ready to beam to the gateway. Who are you talking to? Have you gone mad? So Unfortunately, we have. To go through the fortress, brace yourself, Brewer. You're going to meet more of us, Knights of the Fallen Order. Wait, I haven't agreed to. Yeah, it is. It is. A, it is grainy, but that then, but the the maybe it's just emphasised with the fact that it is grey and not black. Well, well, I thought Solo the Moth had left the order forever. Stay hidden, Alchemist, and allow me to retreat this scene fast. Who are you even talking to? I mean, this is kind of cool. I like that you can see these different pathways. Who are you? Uh, I'm nothing more than a gust of wind that could easily blow you both away. <laughs> and what is this terrible drought and vicious smell you brought in with you? Smell? You mangy? Mangy. Master Kane, I'm just passing through. Okay. The light is expecting your services. Solar the transient. Uh, transient. I won't let you go without responding to the call. I, w I wanted to move on, but... Why would you ever need my help? The Order is in crisis. Our brother and sister knights are in disarray, scattered through the realm of matter. Where is this? Oh, there he is there. They may be lost or injured or worse. All the while the forces of darkness stalk the land and threaten the gateway itself. Do you realise that the alchemists of old may indeed have been re uh, released to tyrannize the realm of matter once more. How do I? Do I have to press one option? Oh my god, I can't do it now. <laughs> the promise age. It's the last time <laughs> what I told you. <laughs> Stop fussing like a child, Solo. The return of the alchemist is a scourge we are quite unprepared to meet. I don't know what I'm saying here. Tell me what is to be done then. Okay. I need you, Solar the Moth, Solar the Unruly, to go forth into the realm of matter and bring back our righteous knights and recover the two powerful artifacts they carried. From here we can recoup and rally. Do you understand and accept your mission? Please be accept. Find the artifacts of light and any surviving knights of the order and bring them back here. Fine, I'll do it. Good. There may be some hope for you, Solar. Seek one group in the refinery and the other two in the peaks. Yeah. Sounds like a busy day ahead of me. I'll be on my way, Kane. Go and do not stray from the path of the light. Talk to Kane again to be able to train Solar in a new attack combo. Master Kane. What do you want, Solar? Services. I need your help. You'll always be a lost child, Sailor. What services of mine? Train. I want to increase my fighting skills. Here we go. So I need this credit. The charge attacks and that. Fuck! 
Okay. So. I guess we'll go up here first. Uh, okay, that's not one of the ones I need. Oh, it won't let me go. There you go. Yeah, I'm, I'm feeling super low energy because of this game, but this is cool. I like this. That's great. I want to look over the edge. <laughs> Don't talk to this, please. What happened here? One of our knights fallen this close to the fortress and the path of the refinery is completely blocked. Intriguing. This barrel is put up to keep something in or out. But it would come from my brother who once ruled the peaks. Another alchemist. You know they were all defeated in prison hundreds of years ago, right? You heard the old dog. The alchemists have been liberated. If he were free, he would return to the peaks. Or perhaps he left us clues to his mixtures using our ancient glyphs. Either way, let us away to the peaks region still yeah enough talking agreed to the peaks to comfortably look back turn either left or right that's cool looking down there That's the checkpoint, isn't it? Ah, oh, we can do this. Oh, it's that side. An ancient glyph, I can guess you can read them. There is far more to Mercury than the horizon of silver. Your alchemist really had metal on the mind. Can I go down there? Nice. Nope. Oh, I'm over the edge. Right. Can I make the bounce one? No. To dash into the air and press X again to spread moss wings to glide through the air. I mean, that's, that's cool. That is really cool, actually. I like that. Travel across these big areas. Oh, it doesn't last forever. Just want to be careful there. Yeah, I wish the resolution was better. Wow, the the fact that we've come all the way down here though is is pretty awesome. It's like such a big open area. Like what? Have I got it? Okay. So these environments, like... Oh. Cool fella. Okay, we've got another one of these. The rusted cannon starts at the bottom to reach the top. Sorry, I'm not reading it. I'm just getting a bit bored of reading it. Okay, collected one of them. Light seed. The very essence of light, isn't it? Breathtaking its brightness. 
No, the light when you jump is a good thing. Astrobot uses it. A lot of games use it because it's really good. Just get a sense of where you are. It's a light seed. Okay. Right. Climb that? You can. Are these enemies? Glue the metal tentacle to the ground. You can safely pass or even attack the tentacles to claim a prize. Okay. Where's the glue? Is it this? That didn't work. I guess you're going to do it once. Didn't get a prize. That was disappointing. Haptics when you're shaking the mixture is good, but the haptics in like combat is just pretty disappointing. Right, is that how you do it? The combat just feels really... Um, like there's just, there feels no... There, it seems to, feels no weight to it or significance. It all feels very bland. But maybe it's because I'm as light as a moth. The way that the music and the environment is just so low energy, I feel like the stream's boring because I'm not saying anything. So hopefully it's just kind of cool to take in because that's kind of what I feel like doing at the moment. Am I just going to keep hitting that? I mean, art style is, in places, it's all right, um, but just, where am I meant to bounce to? Am I meant to double up? Resolution isn't great. I don't know how you get up there. Getting a lot of these crap. 
credits in it. Yeah, agreed. It's all very spaced out and just like you have these big open spaces, but like right now I'm just like I just want to get to where I want to go like right, I need to work out how to get up here. Let's try this again. Hello, welcome, welcome. Hope you're doing well, everyone. Uh, people saying, is it like moss? I wouldn't say that, because you're sort of moving around. I guess it's got some elements to it, but... Well, I don't know how we're supposed to get up there. And I don't want to... Um Say dash onto it. Okay, that works. Yay! Right, now I can't see. Dashing onto it is definitely the solution. I don't know how you can undo these mixtures. Throw repel mixture on the living rocks to be able to bounce them far into other enemies. Wow. That went absolutely flying. See, that is a really cool thing. There's just no sense of impact of it. Like, when you hit it in, it's there's no haptic or anything. I mean...
guess that's... Okay. Nice. Oh. Nice. Can I get across there? Yeah. Okay, up here. I like it sort of gives you the uh, line, so if you're looking away, so you know where your character is. I don't like these people, they're having to hold it up. Some great ideas in this game, though. Right. There we go. Oh, man. This is not working out for me. Keep running. Oh, here we go. No. I might actually die now. Well, I do want to go down there, but they're flying in. Yeah, you might learn that ability at some point. Right, I'm going to try and get this one up here. Oh, I can't. Right, here we go. So. <gasps> no! That is the worst death ever. Just sort of scraping along the side and going, eh. Wow, okay. Oh! Was that not. That was funny. I thought that was pretty badass. Classic Miles? What's Classic Miles? How dare you? How dare you? Oh no, I've got no more. No! Why'd you run out? Do you know what I mean? Like, you die and there's just no music. There's nothing. It's just like... I guess maybe they're going for realism. But it's just like... It just feels so one note. So far... White board. Right, let's just wait. There we go, did it this time. There we go. That's it. Wow. Couldn't kill it. What?
It might pick up though. Like, let's wait and see. What the f What? Every time I die, I'm not thinking, oh, I can't wait to give that another go, I've got it next time. I'm thinking, oh, I've got to do it again. That doesn't look good. Go on. That looked dodgy, but I'll take it. There we go. Oh, there we go. So you can hit him well there. In the sky. Jammy, skillful. Okay, well, what am I doing here? I guess I'm going above it first. You gotta be kidding me if I gotta go all the way back. Oh no, okay, that's. Uh, I don't think I deserve that, but I'll take it because I would have hated to have to do all that again. Kill enemies while they're under a mixture influence. This will get them transmuted into a healing element for the night. Yeah, exactly. It could improve as you unlock more. It's just a very slow start, and these loading screens are so obnoxious. Happy Friday, everyone. If you're watching live, hope you are doing good. Next time, kill them after I throw my mixtures moth. They will transmute into reduced essence. Keep up. I like that I didn't have to use auto aim. I'm proud for that. All this stuff's great. And it kind of gives me the feel of like Journey or something. Oh, I'd love Journey in VR. Okay, we got a boss now. I like this. Wow, head went flying. Down you go. Oh, another?
I just feel like the sound mixing in this game isn't great either. I just constantly feel like I'm not hearing properly. Peaks. It all sounds just so far away and echoey. Which makes me think, am I doing something wrong? I assume this is lava. No. Nope. Or it is, and I'm not dead because of it. the health that is represented around them I think could be clearer. Some of the enemies it's easier to see it on, others not so much. Oh, do they fight each other? Camera angle changes are odd as well. Like you're looking one way and then you're like not sure where you're going to be transported to. Stuff like this is great, but like right now, this angle, like, a delay between action and audio. I mean, I've never had delay issues on the stream before. You tell me, chat. I mean, they're de I'm definitely, now you've mentioned it, the, it doesn't seem to sync up with... Some of it does. But when you're doing the combo... Things like that are great. No, no, no. I knew I messed up as soon as I did it. So this is kind of cool, using the um, the glue mixture to keep that. I think the mixture mechanic is an interesting one, and.
Down you go. Oh no. I guess I don't want to stand on them. Try and knock it onto off the edge. No. They kept in. Agreed. There is a lot with this game that I like. Like I, I like a lot of the ideas. I don't like a lot of the execution. There just seems to be no... Do you know what I mean, though? Like, again, they might have gone, we, we don't want to add music because it artificially adds drama to what you're doing, whereas at the moment, this just feels like... You know, when people do those memes online of, like, this is what a music video would have sounded like without the music, and it's all the, like, awkward sounds of, like, feet slamming on the floor and that. This is what this feels like. Like, unless there's... I've turned music off, but I don't think I have. I keep thinking, like, am I out of it? Is there something wrong with me? Right, I need to heal. How do I heal? I remember at the start thinking I was going to have to turn back and then actually being able to fall the way down. Oh man, these loading screens are killers. Like, why isn't. Why don't they do a fade away? This is. See, that right now is really good. The environment, like, stuff like this is amazing. The other golems, are they frozen or are they just moving too slowly to notice? With golems, it is sometimes hard to tell. Their race seems less animated by the day. 
The alchemy that gives them life is running out. We alchemists have been away far too long. Not all are convinced that is the real problem. the character now on the stream. And that's fine. Not all games are good for streaming. And I do wonder if I wasn't streaming it, would I be more immersed in it? That's a real possibility as well. I'm always open to these things. Watching live and uh, games cast, there is there isn't one tonight. No, Brian's having the week off, which he well and truly is. Uh, I kind of feel like sorry, guys, I'm so low energy, but I'm just like really struggling with this. <laughs> right. I just want to get to the end of the section. like working out what mixtures you need and that is also the case there are going to be people that will absolutely love this game and I think amazing if that is the case but you know just when I don't enjoy a game I'm always I like to straw men or should I say steel men um the, the game and like wonder is there something I'm missing or not paying attention to that's meaning I'm missing out on this but I mean the combat these combat pieces are good Those that were tuned in to the last stream, there was a joke running around about one of the glitches in the game. I've added to my store um, <laughs> an item. What foul creatures are these? They are ingeniously assembled. Whatever their moral compass. Find time to admire. Like the, the writing in this is actually pretty good. Um, I just don't like standing here clicking through stuff. Helen, 
Something big is coming our way. I can feel it. Oh, wow. Here we go. Are they coming to me or am I going to them? Oh, that's the answer. Thank you. Oh, wow. See, what a camera change. See, a fellow knight at last hide yourself. When I had my body, I towered over the land I could no more be hidden. So sorry, people. You can pause it if you want to read it. Can I reset the camera? Oh, there we go. Nice. This is amazing. I don't know if I've been missing these, but I haven't seen any of those um, for a while. Right, I think I need one more, and then I've got enough for my upgrade. I think it was 15 I needed for a charged attack. It's going to go loading screen. Oh, wow. See, this stuff is amazing. These big enemies, I love it. Love it. I think that's great. But again, there's no oomph behind it. Like, it could be a really dramatic moment. No, there won't be any Twitch stream after this. I need to get some food and then I'm probably going to rest because um, it's been a very long week for me. But um, hopefully at the weekend. stuff. Unless it's not. Oh, it's that, innit? There we go. I actually did a, an episode of Miles Die Alive all about how I make my thumbnails. I don't know if anyone can link it in the chat, but um, I go through the whole, entire process. Combat's good. I like the combat in this game a lot. Wow. Off the edge you go. the uh, sticky stuff up there.
Whoa, oh, that was close. hard to see from here. Okay, I got something from that one. There we go, got something from that one as well. I don't know what it is, those little triangles, but... Oh, it's health, isn't it? Oh. Okay. Now, I'm assuming I'm going to have to jump. Oh, there's something up there that I still need. And there's something around there to draw on that I've just connected to. So let me go back up there. Go 17. I feel like it should start with the number you've had already and then it... Nope, not going to make it from there. So, I know what I've got to do. Oh, that's good. Okay. The spawn points are pretty good. Oh, the other one didn't appear back. Why is it not appeared back? Is that meant to have appeared back? What do we think? There's something I'm missing. I feel like that block was supposed to have come back. Oh. Oh, now it appears. Wow. See, stuff like that's pretty, pretty cool in the game. That was not cool. No, that didn't work either. So I'm supposed to block it, I guess. I'm supposed to block it. be good to get over there, which I assume you achieve by There 
we go. Oh. I feel like the fact I haven't gone over that checkpoint doesn't matter. I feel like if I die, I will respawn there. I mean, I'm not going to try it. Love knocking their heads off. Do you know what I might do tonight, people? I might get some good food and then get Amazon Prime Video and watch the new um, Fallout series. Um, oh, the depths of what was it? You don't want any of that? Oh, hello. Kill it. Airy the Owl. How can... How came you? How came you? How come you to be trapped thusly? Or maybe that's how they speak. So the that. moth. How is it I came to be rescued by you? Two shells passing in the night, and now I must hide again. Fati. What was that? Lazar Podar. Caverns echoing distressingly. Calm yourself. You've been along, alone too long in the dark. What happened? Taren, I retrieved the light artifacts dropped in the canyon, and I was bringing it to the beacon to dispel the alchemical power massing this realm. When I was set upon by an enormous beast, he tried to drop an avalanche upon me in the crater, but I was able to escape to the caves just in time. We need that artifact and you back at the fortress, Master Kane has ordered us to regroup. I tried my best, but the beast was too strong, yet I don't want to return to the fortress with the light artifact undelivered. Is this it? Is this... It's under your feet. Lago. Yes, take it. Moro. I'm injured and need to return to the fortress. You will need to deliver the artifact for me. I'll do it. See the animation. This the animations are great. Just sneak into the artifacts from under the beast's nose, so nothing too difficult then. Well, it should be placed in the beacon, as that was my original mission. Sure, no problem. Easy as falling off a golem. golem. I think you'll find it harder. I've carefully studied the way of alchemy. I'm trying my hardest to read all this. Ever since I arrived in the realm of matter, the better to ward against its vile energy. So if I struggled against the alchemical beast, you'll find it doubt doubly difficult an opponent. Quite right, nevertheless, you may find this useful. It is glyph a part of a large alchemic formula. It modifies the stability of fluid substances. Boom. Farewell, Silo the Moth, and good luck. Shake mixtures in your hands to give them more explosives power. Okay, that's awesome.
do it down nice. Climb up there? No, I can't. I gotta go on this. I died. I died. I'm all the way back here. Please don't tell me I have to speak to that person again. The owl. I just get too greedy with my hits. I need to be better at like stepping away for a bit. Okay. All right. straight away. Down you go. Whether I die or complete this, I'm giving my final thoughts after this battle. still there. That makes the head come off. I love that. Ah, oh, more. I do think the game would benefit if it was less like rinse and repeat. Like if if there was always just one wave of enemies, I think it would feel a lot better. But you just feel like, oh, how many more? I mean, sometimes for like boss battles and that, I guess. But Maybe I've got to do a big one on it. No? No? Oh, 
No. How do I get up there? Let's try one more time. No. And, oh, is it the bounce pad? No. There we go. There, oh, it was that. Nice. Wow. This is a great environment. Solar, I see you have secured and unlocked the gates of the crater. Most impressive. Here the owl lies wounded in the caverns and needs our help. Has she retrieved the artifact? Yes, she has given it to me to deliver to the beacon. With your permission, of course. I see. I have my doubts to be sure. You've been the weak link of our order for quite a while, Solar the Moth. Your pursuits of wayward desires is what resulted in your low status at the gateway outpost. But the time has come, and I place the fate of the order in your hands, but no, you're on probation. Thank you, Master Kane. It means a lot to me. I cannot listen anymore. I'm going to be sick. What was that? I said we should hurry up to help poor Eri. I will take care of it, but what's more urgent is for you to take the artifact and place it at the beacon on top of the Great Peak. Will you be able to find Eri in the caverns on your own? No need, child. I will use the beams of Bast to get her here. It will not take long to set them up. You may use them yourself Talk. on your return. Thank you, Master Kane. Best of luck, Child of Light. And then let's just, before we wrap it up, their designs are just really cool. Oh, I wish you could get closer, but their designs are really cool. Services. I need your help. Train. Here we go. Also, you can choose charge attacks or advanced combos. Easily switch between slash and stab combos, mixing up new combos. Powerful attacks but limited mobility and slower in delivery. I think we'll do that. Charged attack. There we go. Yali. Okay. Fuck. Maka. Okay. No, 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 I was trying to attack. No, leave. That's cool. Like it, like it, like it. So. It said triangle was for setting. Oh, you hold it. Okay. Did I have music turned off? No. All right, everybody, that was my let's play of Mixture. I want to thank again Perp Games and uh, Played With Fire for the game key. Here are my final thoughts. Firstly, graphics. Art style is awesome. I do like it, but I feel that the fidelity is lacking and you get to some areas where the textures are just so flat and uninspired and especially in big open areas, it doesn't quite work, especially when your camera is so close to the ground. So I think the game is okay. Uh, I like the characters up close. I think they look awesome. I like the animations of them. Um, and the, the, as I said, the art style is, is, is cool, but... Um, I wish when you were in the caverns, like, the darkness looked dark. That would have been really, really nice. Secondly, the audio. 
I like the little voices as they're talking. But the audio feels a bit out of sync in the fighting. It doesn't feel that impactful. And then it's very one note. On the one hand, I'm like, are they just going for like a really chilled, atmospheric mood? But you have these like big people appear and like the big enemies and that look awesome. And there's just nothing behind it. You get into these big battles, there's no change. There's like no change of gear. It's just one note all the way through. And I wonder if that was just a choice of like, no, we want it to feel real. That you are in this world and this is what it is. We don't want to overblow what you're feeling just with like by art or we don't want to artificially inflate the feeling with music but i just feel it's just incredibly one note and therefore uninspired for that reason haptics the haptics are great when you're doing the mixing but the haptics it really ends there i think there are some subtle haptics here and there but i just feel there's a great opportunity to incorporate it into the fighting so that you feel the combat feeling the uh, sword hitting the enemies making it so you're more immersed in the battle because the fighting itself and this gets to the last point the gameplay did i have fun playing this you might think i'm going to say no the first 15 minutes to half an hour was an absolute no i found this incredibly boring and i was like oh, i'd rather be doing other things but when you get to the really good platform sections where you're going across big, large areas, when the platform sections are done well, they're really good, like the gliding around. When the platform sections aren't good, it's frustrating and annoying, but I do think the checkpoint system is fair. And as for the fighting, um, I wish it was a little less repetitive with the waves in each area. I wish that maybe there was just more enemies to begin with and that once you cleared them out, that was it. But the fighting, I think, is great. I like the idea of using the mixtures and learning which mixtures are good against which enemies and what they do for each. Um, so, in its strongest moments, I did actually have a good time with this game. And I wonder if in a different context when not live streaming or, you know, sometimes we have good days and sometimes we have bad days. Maybe I'm just feeling a bit tired and low-key and it's all been emphasised by the atmosphere this, this game creates. Um, but the camera angles are often awkward. Um... But I do like the fact that you move with the character through it. There is just way too much talking. And when I say talking, I mean text to flick through to the point that, look, I don't want to disrespect the people that write it. I'm sure there's a great story there. Sometimes I am into it. I'm just, it's not gripping me. And it will grip some people. So, you know, my, I, I hope people get enjoyment out of this in ways that I didn't. Um, but... Something I said earlier in the game, which I think really summarises how I feel about Mixture as a whole, which is there are a lot of great ideas in this game that I really appreciate and enjoy. But it falls short in the execution. And for that, it has some highs and it has a lot of monotonous lows. Um, and so am I going to come back to this game? If I get time, I will do. I'd like to stick with it a bit more and see where it goes. I'd be curious to see, you know, doing another area, how it's going to look. I mean, the, the locations they build look pretty good. I just, again, wish the resolution was better. Um, but uh, <laughs> you could say my thoughts on this are a bit of a mixture. Um, I'm definitely feeling on the low end about this game, though. It's not one that's screaming for me to play more of. I'm actually looking forward to coming out of this for a bit um, but I'm interested to see where it goes there's these big enemies that are teased and you know the snake boss at the beginning was kind of interesting and I'd be interested to see where it goes from there if there's more interesting platform m platformer sections and, and battles and different mixtures then um, yeah that could be really interesting as well so those were my thoughts what were your thoughts if you've played this game what do you think of it have you played it on other platforms I believe it's a quest port um, and if you um, are watching this on replay let me know in the comments section below would really really appreciate it now before I wrap things up um, I'm just going to turn the audio on so I can hear the chat but um, I think uh, oh I just got to give a massive thank you to <laughs> Nihilus Ryan the game feline 
He says, appreciate your honest takes on these games, Miles. Well, thank you. I mean, I always feel bad. Um, Kira says it has a hollow feel to it, and I think that's a really great way of putting it. Um, it, it, it does. It just it feels just like a bit empty and desolate and not in a good way. Because sometimes, and, and maybe it would work in some places if it was then really lifted in those big battles. But there's just no real like liftingness of it of like yes I'm in it and that doesn't necessarily have to come just from music that could come from really good use of F uh, sound effects and haptics combined I mean the tools that PSVR 2 offers you there are some real opportunities there so look um, is this is not a write-off of this game and improvements can be made um, but as things currently stand I am on more of the mess side with it uh, and that's just me I want to say a massive thank you to everyone for tuning in and joining me. Really, really appreciate it. And thank you to everyone that supports this channel. Uh, Nihilist Ryan, the Game Feline, thank you so much for the super chat. Thank you to everyone that just sat, enjoyed it, joined me and pressed the like button. And if you are new to this channel, do subscribe and ring the bell to be notified of all future Let's Plays because I'm on a mission to Let's Play every single PSVR 2 game out there. And finally, before I go, just to justify uh, what you can see on the screen at the bottom, making sure my audio works this time when I do this because it keeps turning it off every time. Uh, this is my merch, which you can find at questforempathy.com. Uh, and this isn't the only stuff that is sold. You can see me wearing the shirt at the moment. And having got the shirt, it feels so good. The material is so comfortable. I love it. And if you use the code QUESTLAUNCH at checkout, you get 10% off. But um, you'll see under this video a list of the items, so feel free to click on them, and it just supports me and helps me out. But if you do buy any of these, I do send you a personal thank you message, um, and it just helps support the channel. So with all that said and done, I just want to say one more time, thank you so much for watching. Take good care of yourselves, and I look forward to seeing you on the next Let's Play. Bye-bye. <laughs>